Well, for many girls, the first time they really dress up for a formal event is for high school homecoming and prom. But many young ladies might not go because they can't afford the dress. Apolina uh, Pacheco is the founder of Gowns for Her. She is joined by Connie Jackson, the pastor of St. John Northwest. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having us. All right. This is something that's very personal for you. It is. And I always say sometimes you don't choose your mission, but your mission chooses you. That's right. What was it like for you when there were dress up things to go to when you were young? Sure. So it was very hard for me because we couldn't afford those type of things. So mm -hmm. that was an extra and you just couldn't do that. Yeah. So you had to borrow things. I had to borrow things. And so I knew how that made me feel. Yeah. And so I wanted to create something where I can give back and do what I didn't have the opportunity no. to what have. What did you create? Do. So I created a program. It's called Gowns for Her. And uh, we promote self-esteem, self-worth, and self-confidence by giving gowns to girls that are underserved in our community. Yeah, and Connie, as a pastor and as a motivational speaker and somebody who's a great leader in our community, you know what it's like for a girl to be at something that's kind of an elevated event, some place that a lot of the girls feel like they, they don't have a right to be at, and they do. Absolutely. One of the things we understand at St. John Northwest is that we're not just spiritual beings, we're social beings. Mm -hmm. yeah. And so we have we to make... don't quarantine the church on Sunday morning. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right. Yeah, right. Yeah. Before you go to heaven, you got to go to the prom. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Uh, and so we wanted to partner with Gowns for Her and Apollonia Pacheco to make our facilities available. And we have an event planner and a celebrity uh, makeup artist uh, who's going to be there on Saturday, April 6th, to uh, help these young ladies feel beautiful and to let them know that they can be princes for a day as yeah. well. And, and princes but, but for also said something else to them. It's kind of like you, it's not, we, so many times in society we go, oh, those are the important people. You're yes. important too. That's right. Absolutely. Right? You That's can be right. in the room too. Absolutely. And right. we know that clothes don't make the man, right, or the woman. That's but right. when you feel good and you look in the mirror from the from the outside, it Absolutely. makes you feel good on the inside as well. Absolutely. You Indeed. only do this in a couple times uh, a year here in Houston, right? Yes. So during prom and homecoming season, and we're operating in three cities. So we're in the Arklatex area, San Antonio, and Houston. Okay. Donations. Uh, you, you taken year round, but you know yes, gowns, yeah. new makeup. If you dug in it to test the color, we don't want that. <laughs> okay. New makeup, <laughs> shoes, accessories, anything that can complete an outfit, Absolutely. we can donate and make yes, a difference in a young woman's yeah. life. All right. Gowns for Her is hosting their last event before prom season this Saturday from 11 to 3 p.m. at St. John Northwest Church. For more information, visit greatdayhouston.com. All right, I think we're going to end the show with the reception and the party. Pastor Connie Apollonia, if you want to join us, there you go.